Hey guys, welcome back with Nate. <laughs> <clears throat> We're gonna do kind of a Q and A. I got a whole bunch of questions that I can ask him, mm -hmm. and he can ask me as well. Um, we just got our marriage certificate in the mail yesterday, so and that's the good thing. Yeah. So yeah, it's gonna be happening soon. Yes, indeed. And um, I just thought, how much do I know about my husband to be, and vice versa. <laughs> So, um, I'm just going to ask some random questions that's on this paper here. And, um, <clears throat> and again, he can ask me too. Um, the first question is, if someone asks, what's the most wonderful or lovable thing about your partner, what would you say? Uh, there's many lovable things about my partner, my wife-to-be. I love your smile, definitely. Beautiful. And you're definitely humble. Right? Okay. And you're happy most of the time. Okay. So. Oh, thank you. Did you want to ask me that question as well? Well, yes. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I do want to know that. What do you think about me? Okay. Um, I think you're handsome. Thank you. I thought that from the very moment that I felt like I met him. Mm -hmm. And they could tell you the story about how he already been knowing you. Knew me. <laughs> For and, um, 10 years and my family mm -hmm. but you know my memory is gone so um but the most wonderful or lovable thing about you is how caring you are towards me definitely care. and care you know, and how you make me feel that you care for me and love me I make you feel happy every day, every moment, every hour of the day. Yeah, yeah. and I know it's not always easy. Yeah, that's good, uh, you know. We are human, though, right? So, that's, that's the most wonderful, lovable thing. Um, question number two. <laughs> um, what one thing about me do you find confusing or difficult to understand? Yeah, well, these questions went deep. I went I to a whole different thing, page. Though, right? I didn't even see these. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, there's, no, there's not really too much difficult. It's not so difficult about you, really. You know, sometimes when you sit to yourself, I'll be wondering what we'll, would we'll be on your mind. And sometimes you'll tell me the truth, but I know deep down inside, there's something that you probably want to keep to yourself. But it's nothing confusing about you, you know. Like I said, I, I've been watching you for a long time. I've I known you for a long time, you know. So your ways are pretty much the same as it was back then, but just a little more than matured. I mean, well, you always carried yourself matured, so I can't say that even. Ever since I've been knowing you have been, you know? Okay. Um, question number three. What's the one small thing I could do on a regular basis that I don't do regularly now? That you can do? Yes. One, one small thing that I can do on a regular basis but I don't do now. Wow. I can't even answer that. Because, I mean, you still do the thing that you did when we got together that you do now. You still do the same thing. So well, it's not so something that 
I should be doing on a regular basis. Well, I'm you know, doing. we'll get to that thought later. <laughs> you know what I mean? No, nah, but no, you good though, sweetie. Okay, yeah, right. next question. All right. <laughs> okay. Um, is there anything... Oh, no. Okay, we don't skip that one. Mm -hmm. um, if you can have your own perfect day from getting up in the morning to falling asleep at night, what would that day look like? Well, to be for real with you, like every day I would want it to look the same. And that's me and you chilling together and doing what we do. Like go out and have ourselves some fun, even just not partying or nothing like that. We could just hang out together, you know. But we have to work. But like you said, if it was the day that we didn't have to work, yeah, it's just your perfect day. Your perfect oh, day. Oh, my was perfect to go to day work. would be hanging with you for real. Okay, because yeah. I know my perfect day would not include working. No, actually, no, my perfect I mean, day from work, getting up in the morning will be getting up, washing up, and getting back in bed, and just chilling. Chilling yeah. all day. You know, watching TV or yeah. or listening to music or whatever, but. Just chilling, just relaxing. That would be a perfect together. Day. Yeah. Yes, that's what I'm talking yeah. about. You know. Um. Is there anything you really want? Anything that you really want to ask me that you haven't asked for? You haven't realized that you want. Well, I'll tell you one thing, you already know that there's nothing that I really haven't asked you that I really didn't want. I asked you anything. You know, we don't have no secrets. We don't have no, uh, oh, I can't talk to you about this or talk to you about that. We talk to each other about anything and everything. Okay. Right? Yeah. So that was that. That was a whole separate thing that I had just found at the last minute. But these are like average questions. <laughs> and I'm okay. going to ask you these questions, but this is for you to answer for me. Okay. 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 Um, would I choose Facebook or Twitter? Well, I think you would choose Facebook because I, I don't know you would have a Twitter I page. I don't even have a Twitter page. Right. So, That's yeah, I would choose Facebook if I have to choose for them too. Right. And the same with Nate, right. I would believe. Yeah, I would yeah, choose Facebook. Like you said, you don't have a Twitter page, and I don't, so I know Twitter was out. Um, do I tend to run late, early, or on time? A little bit in between. There ain't no in between. Well, in between you sometimes you're late, sometimes you're on time. So, right? so you're talking about doing anything? Is yeah, this specific just, thing you're talking about? No, just in general. Typically. Well, sometimes. <clears throat> I can say sometimes. We both run late. You, you can never be on time, on time, all the time. That's sometimes you do. Okay. Not all the time. You know what I mean? But I'm not usually early. Um, yes, you are sometimes. That's why I say it's, it's in between thing. Sometimes you're early. Sometimes you're late and sometimes you're on time, you know? Okay. That's probably right, because I probably would answer it the same way. Yeah, it, you? you know. Um, now, let me say something, though. Yes. Now, me asking you that question about me. I would say the same thing. No. If I... If, I, mean, I would say I, you I, in between. You'll run late, early, or... Sometime on time. time, but, but mostly you early. Yes. Very right, right, early. Right, right, right. <laughs> you know, but if we trying to, you know, go out or something like that. Oh, then we're going to uh, drag a pinch. Yeah. You know, a but, pinch, not a lot. It's going right, to be a pinch. Right, but your thing is definitely early. <laughs> but then it could be, sometimes you might be late. Right. Sometimes you might be running late. Sometimes you might be running on time. Mm -hmm. But for work... Super 
let's see. Um, <clears throat> when was the last time we saw a movie? And what was it? Wow. The last time we saw a movie, we went to the Rotunda. And it was The Invisible Man. Oh my goodness, baby. The last time we saw a movie was on Netflix about Boy, you 25 me. minutes about, ago. You talking about going to the and, movies over here? We was, watch movies here all the time. I know. Well, it doesn't say <laughs> go to a movie. Oh, well, okay. Well, well yeah, we just watched the movie within a half an hour ago. Yeah. Let's say that. And it okay. was called Prince of, the Prince of Persia. Persia. Right? Yeah. Yes, we just got finished watching that movie. Yes, we watch movies or okay. uh, episodes. See, or I thought you day. were talking about but, going to the movies. Okay, but if we went to the movies, you're yeah. yeah, we went to the movies. We right, just before, um, the yeah, right, just before Corona. Right, just before Corona. Went to the rotunda. I remember laid back in the chair with my uh, Long Island iced tea. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. A rotunda is a adult movie theater for um, ages twenty one and over. Um, they serve drinks and dinner and stuff right to your seat. Mm -hmm. Very comfortable seat, a nice atmosphere. And we went there just before the corona, the corona hit. And I'm glad and we did that. It was empty. It was empty in yes. the movie. But just before that, they I mean, right after that, they closed down the theaters and everything else in the that. world. Mm -hmm. Um... So we still be getting our little get out and get out, take a drive somewhere, you know. Mm -hmm. Just me and my baby, you know, going and chilling and having us a little ball. <laughs> All right, let me ask um, about seasons and holidays. Um, do I like to dress up for Halloween? No. I can tell you no. That's absolutely right. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely right. I definitely don't celebrate the holidays like that. Yeah, especially that one. Mm -hmm. Um, what would I love to do on a hot summer day? Wow, uh, just lay back and chill, stay cool. Oh, be oh, we would love to go to the beach every now and then. Mm -hmm. But you know, this uh, outbreak put a shutdown on most of that. You know, so we hang, we just get out. Okay. We just chill out, though, you know. All right, so this is a work related question. Um, what was my first job? Your first job, I believe, was working at McDonald's or Wendy's. <laughs> it was one of them, too, right? Um, Technically, I think it was Wendy's. It, no, I, I never worked for Wendy's. It was McDonald's. McDonald's, okay. But technically, McDonald's was not my first paid job. When I was in high school, I was on a work to school program. That means the you youth entitlement about, program. Huh? The youth entitlement? I don't think that's what it was called when it I was It was called that when I was in high but school. They just called it a um, work to school program. I worked um, part of my. Um, yeah. day and then I go to school for the other half of okay. my day or vice versa. Yeah. And I used to work for um like this mailing company. All I did was like stuff envelopes. Oh, <laughs> and stuff okay. Like that. I, I I remember that. But back, and I was then. filing stuff but then, you know, I got paid for it. Right. Like a prior stipend, but mm -hmm. I got paid for that and I was going to school at the same time and it's my job performance there was my grade in school. I was like in a okay. business class. That was sort of that. like what I did the youth entitlement because if you if you didn't do good in school and you didn't stay in school, you didn't have that job. Mm -hmm. So, you know. Mm -hmm. And that's what you did? Was that your first job? The youth entitlement? The youth entitlement? Mm -hmm. Yes, I was working for a Dunbar daycare. Mm -hmm. You know? Mm -hmm. <laughs> yes, indeedy. Yeah. First tax paying job, you know, they mm -hmm. take a tax out of my right. money. And I didn't know anything about right. that. I'm like, you know, I don't, at that age, I wasn't doing nothing with the money no way. I was giving it to my mother. Right. You know? <laughs> so, you know, you get money like that, you what, 14, 15 years old. That's how we grew up. Nowadays, they'll find something to do with the money. Mm -hmm. You know, don't want to give your parents nothing. 
they, they don't want to get their parents to do anything but do what they want to do with their money. But I was the type of person that had to learn to uh, help pay bills. Right. You know what I'm saying? Right. All right. So I'm going to ask a few more questions. Um, and this is basically just random questions that I know you know the answer okay. to these. Um, do I prefer um, my coffee hot or iced? Uh, hot. Yes. And he don't drink coffee. No. So, um, if I opened a restaurant, what kind of food would I serve? I can assure you probably serve, um, let's say soul food. Okay. That's the kind of restaurant I think that you will open. Yes. Well, uh, so yours food. would be um, Islamic food? Mine's would be like sandwiches. Okay. I would have more like a, a deli. Shop, yeah. I would have more like a little deli shop okay. opposed to a restaurant. Yeah. I yeah, had yeah. thought about that idea once yeah. before. You yeah. Know, have like a little... Um, you know, sandwich shop with sweets, you know, right. uh, most like pastries and stuff, stuff like well, that. Well, you already know the soul food thing is my thing. That's I cook, thing. I cook, right. cook, you know. Right, so, <laughs> um, do I like spicy food? Of course you like spicy food. I do. You know I don't like spicy don't. food. You don't. Know? <laughs> <laughs> you don't. No, um, I definitely can't do that. What is my favorite restaurant? Mm. Well, we just ate out of the favorite restaurant. Um, what is it? I, let me get it. I keep messing it up though now. It's the uh, Corner Foods, Corner Food Service, right? Uh, corner Food Station. Station, Corner yeah. Food Station, yes. Yes. <laughs> that one. But I, I, yes, I do like that. <laughs> I do like that. Is that my favorite? Uh, I would say yes, and then you have uh, pandas. Mm. But I think that's corner like food station. That's like fast food, though. But yeah, corner food okay. station. Uh, that's what's up there. All right. Okay. Um, what is my favorite cereal? Your favorite cereal? You like uh. Don't say nothing. You like, uh, wow, you like all of them. You like fruit loops. You like um, Cheerios, honey on Cheerios. Right? Mm -hmm. Do you my like favorite Captain cereal. Crunch? <laughs> Captain Crunch? Captain, which Captain Crunch? The uh, peanut butter. That's, right? that's my favorite cereal. Peanut I know you Captain eat all of them, but I know you do like the Captain Crunch peanut butter. That is my favorite cereal. <laughs> right. What is your favorite? So your honey butters of oats? Oh, uh, well, you know that. Honey butters of oats and uh, honey nut Cheerios. Honey nut Cheerios. Yeah, I eat rice krispies every now and then, but I like the honey butters of oats and uh, honey nut Cheerios. Um, what's my favorite snack? Favorite snacks? Snack. Just it's, um, well, you like donuts, right? Mm -hmm. You like donuts do. and, and uh, it's something else. Well, you will say the donuts because you don't eat the cookies as much. Yeah, I was going to say <laughs> your favorite snack is cookies. Yeah, yeah, it's time to cookies. Be specific. <laughs> it is the, um, the crunchy um, Chip Ahoy cookies right, the, right. Uh, and the blue pack. Yeah, they and know. they can't be broken, you know. You nah, gotta feel the no top and make sure cookies. they wasn't broken. Those stock people nowadays, they gotta put the pack up. Then you go and get a pack and bring it home. You got a bunch of crumbs in the dog on thing. Well, most of the cookies are broken up, and I don't like that. You know, that's I don't want no cereal cookies. I want okay. the cookie cookies. So these are all mostly food questions. I'm trying to well, get to uh, something else. Um, um, where did we take our first picture? You want me to name together. the place? The first picture together. Yeah, that's fine. The Horseshoe. The Horseshoe Casino. Yeah, right at the bar. Mm. Right? Yeah. Um, how 
between the two of us, who is better with money? You are definitely. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Without a doubt. Wow. That's why I give that, you that most must make of him mine. Like, awful you know, with money. <laughs> yeah, well, trust me, I ain't good with it at all. <laughs> I can spend it. <laughs> um, you know, order some stuff online that, you know. I spend it. Let's see. Do I still have my wisdom teeth? No. I don't think so. No. Okay. I should have. I really know you don't. I, I think. <laughs> um. Yeah, I think we pretty much, you know, Nailed answered them. a lot of questions. I mean, it was just some. Um, but is there anything that you want to ask me that um, I haven't asked, or anything you want to tell YouTube that um, I didn't ask or didn't mention? Well, I can say to YouTube that. I think that I was running in a circle the whole time looking for something that was right in my face. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. But I think the timing was wrong back then. So when we, where we at right now, it's time that's perfect because we're right where we're supposed to be. And I'm very happy to be in this relationship with you. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. And I've been looking at you the whole time. You was, you know, teenager growing up and all that time around me. But you don't remember me. But trust me, I remember you and your brothers, your, your brothers and your mother and father. And they remember me. But you don't remember because most teenage girls don't pay no attention to older guys. Mm -hmm. You was all about trying to go to school and hang with your friends and all that. And this, it, it was a good thing, though. You know, I spoke and all of that, and that was cool. You know, and I, like I said, out of respect to the uh, out of respect to your mother and your father, I didn't and respecting you, I didn't try to holler at you back then. You know what I mean? I do. Yeah, but right now I'm glad uh, that we've been put together because when, as a matter of fact, I can say we we got linked up at right mm -hmm. the Facebook thing, and I didn't know who you were because mm -hmm. I didn't know your first name. Yeah, you know, I didn't know your real name, I just knew your nickname. Yeah. So when we were on the Facebook thing and you changed over the years. I go by Lily, by the way. Right. And your real name is Alita and like I said, I didn't know that that name. But I didn't know who you was. I knew that nickname that was on the on the page, but I didn't find out who you was until we started off talking about the area we was up we was from. And we started talking about the area that we were from and I remember like I do know you, but you didn't know me, you know. And all the time, like with that, I was trying to. My mind was there to be with you the whole time back then, but I was like, no, she's too young. She ain't ready for that. You know what I'm saying? So, and, and I definitely wasn't. Yeah. So I was like, you had to do what you had to do back then and get what you had to get out of your system. I did what I did. Get up what I had out of my system and go through life the way I went through life. You went through life where you went through life, and now we're here together. You know mm -hmm. where it should be. You know. Yeah, you're soon to be my wife. Yes. Without a doubt, right? So yes, I'm happy about that. I'm happy that we did come across each other and to be in this relationship that we in together because I'm very happy about that, you know? Yeah, I am too. Yeah. <clears throat> so to let the YouTubers know that we're not strangers. You know, we've, oh. been on each other. we've been around each other for a long time, you know? We're talking like 30 more years, 30 years or more, yeah. over 30 years. And we're going to get married, y'all, Yes, indeed. And like they said, when you say your soulmate, you don't know your soulmate is near you. They could be near you the whole time. You'll never know until time ready for y'all to be together. You know, when it's time for y'all to be together, you will know. Trust me. And nothing going to separate that. All right? All right. Well, to everybody, thanks for watching. And uh, I do thank you for watching. And... Enjoy, like, and share. Like, and comment. And subscribe. Comment. Right. <laughs> subscribe. Thank you so much for watching, guys. All right. See you next time. <laughs>